Hi guys, my name is Omer and you are watching Omer's workshop. Today we are going to talk about this brooder which is specially made for Macau and the lovebirds and other birds as well because it is a, a very good uh, brooder for uh, keeping them warm when they hatch. So it is a size is 18 by 18 inches and height is 2 feet. It doesn't matter you can make any size it is just a concept to make the warm box for the newborn chicks so it is uh, powered by W3001 this is a controller which uh, controls that heater which is 50 watt is ceramic heater over here we are gonna slide the glass and that is a ceramic heater which is uh, being turned on and off by this uh, temperature controller and there is a fan on top of it which is throwing air from the outside inside over the heater so all the box have the same heat inside so this is a sensor which is sensing the temperature inside is 33.3 right now and it's making around 5 minutes first time to reach about 35 and after that it's taking uh, one minute to turn on and off from 32 to 35 see uh, you can uh, set it by yourself it is very easy to wiring and set it because whatever the voltage is getting like 220 and then it's gonna relay the exact same voltage to that heater which is 220 as well after that we have this LED button which will turn on and you can see it's turned off and it's uh, looking really dark here because if we take away the light and this is very dark and if we uh, close uh, open the light we can see from the inside that's why we have the LED so we can see what's going on because that heater doesn't light up it is just heater the ceramic heater with the kanthal wire inside so it is a good uh, setup for using in a brooder which is a square brooder uh, most of the people uh, you know that uh, make uh, round brooders that is for the chicken eggs chicken uh, chicken chicks but this one is for the brooder because they don't really move they stay there at one point and then you feed them then they stay there and after that uh, if you are making a brooder for the chicken chicks you have to make it a round one and if you are placing a very small amount of chicks then it is a good thing for them because uh, in the corners the chicks just uh, burst the first one into the corners and the corner one they don't get oxygen and get very much more heat from other chicks and they get expired that's why we don't make uh, square brooder for the chicks so you can see from the top side the air is getting in and spreading all over inside the box so the material I have used is chipboard lamination uh, or you can use MDF it is MDF or chipboard whatever you can get in the market and I have MDF uh, backboard to mm and the same thing I have placed on to the ground because this is a waterproof material all over it it cannot get wet it is good for the uh, if it get wet by the water it will not get rot so uh, there is also a water paper you have to avoid for if you are using it because it will get uh, the sheet destroyed after that we can see that there is a sensor I have placed over here this is also aluminium sheet uh, covered onto the top which is not necessary but if you can uh, you can place it all over the place to uh, keep the temperature inside and it will keep warm inside as you can see I have the simple wiring over here the 220 is coming in and powering up all the things in here that is the LED heater and this uh, supply 12 volt supply which is powering the fan and this uh, is a direct 220 and this is the LED button as well so this is a very simple wiring if you can search a mares workshop or incubator wiring you can see everything as well because this is basically an incubator 
but we have uh, make a hole on the top side and the outside air is getting in freely so that it become broader if i close that hole and place that fan inside so then it becomes a incubator after that we have to place a uh, water because this is basically a dehydrator it will dehydrate everything it is put in inside if you put a uh, fruit vegetable have anything and keep the temperature up to 40 to 45 it will dehydrate anything so you must keep the water bowl inside so it will keep getting the humidity inside of it but don't place a deep uh, bowl otherwise the chick might get into it so this is a very basic uh, uh, brooder you can make for love birds or any birds or any uh, chicken jigs but very small amount like 10 to 15 or 20 because there is no much space for them after one week you have to keep the temperature lower 3 degrees lower so right now it is 32 and 35 then after one week you have to set the temperature from 29 to 32 so it will keep decreasing the temperature for 3 degrees after every week so if you don't know how to set it you have to keep uh, if you have to you have to press the this button one time and it will show you the open time and this button will show you the closing time the closing temperature at 35 it will turn off the heater at 32 it will turn on the heater and it will keep turn on and off by that system so if you want to set it you have to press it one time on the lower setting you have to then keep pressing the button it will keep blinking so if you want to set any uh, specific temperature like uh, 31.9 and leave it for uh, five seconds then it will go back set it 31.9 and it will go back to temperature that means it have been set on to the open temperature and for the low, uh, higher temperature you have to press one time and it will show you what degree it have been set then keep pressing the button and it will blink just uh, set the temp desired temperature and then it will set it by itself so there is uh, no zero point degree setting only one degree setting from here like if you want to open and off zero one uh, degree like uh, it is uh, uh, yeah possible 32.2 32.5 you can set it but uh, some uh, w3001 have this kind of option that you cannot set zero point degree differences so this one have a option of it so now it's working perfectly it will have been said but be sure that uh, there is no warranty that it will keep working because it might get uh, faulty at any time and you have to replace it quick as possible or if anything happens that this uh, becomes faulty then you can place the lowest heater into the place of a LED so it will keep getting warm but not too much warm like if, if it is working on 50 wattage then you have to place a 10 wattage heater so it will keep working to keep up the temperature up to the from the room temperature so this is a very basic brooder you can make for your birds your uh, newborn chicks which is very, very necessary or you can uh, you don't, don't really have to make this kind of fancy setup you can make it into even the styrofoam box which will be the same setting of the uh, wiring and setting you can search match workshop and search w3001 setting and you can see uh, it is a very basic setting so if you like this video please like share and subscribe have a nice day bye